Good evening, peeps. It's Tammy Brock, reseller on Poshmark, eBay, Facebook Marketplace, and Depop. Um, I haven't done one of these in a while. I did one back in November with my um, sales for November and a haul, but um, I've been so busy and it was really busy during Christmas. So um, this is my first of the year video. I'm going to tell you what my sales were for uh, the month of December. Um, I had 123 orders. I'm not going to go through every one of them. So I had 123 orders. My gross was $2,246.86 and my net was $1,318.09 of which um, $560.97 was my son's. So, um, that was for the month of December. For the year, um, on eBay, um, I grossed, for, this is from December, I mean, uh, January 1st, 2023 to December 31st, 2023. On eBay, I grossed $8,220.99. And on Poshmark, I grossed $8,841.08 for a total gross of $17,062.07. Um, I don't know what my um, net is yet because I'm still um, working on the numbers. I'll try and remember in my next video to let you know. But <clears throat> just wanted to let you see how I'm doing. Um, a little bit better than I thought. So um, November and December were very busy. Um, it has slacked off um, quite a bit, I guess. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm still selling anywhere from, I think, two to five sales a day. Um, so, you know, anything is better than nothing. Or, you know, whatever. I'm not doing it to make a living. So it's just to keep me busy and give me something to do. So I'm going to, I, I've done a bunch of hauls, but like I said, I was so busy that I, um, didn't have time to do any videos. Um, so I'm going to give you some of the hauls that I, um, have done. Um, I did one today at the Salvation Army with their buy the pound sale where everything is a dollar a pound. And I, um, bought a little bit over 16 pounds so it cost me less than 17 dollars and then um i went to uh plato's closet last week and they had 90 percent off of their clearance so i got uh i'll show you one of the dresses i've already put up i've already um uh photographed and put up some of it, uh, I got a, I need to go get the rest of this stuff because I think that, um, some of it I haven't photographed yet. Anyway, I got this cute little free people dress, um, and it was a dollar sixty. It is a maxi dress. Um, I believe it's probably like a small or an extra small. Um, there's the free people tag. So, um, good deal on that. I also went down to, not this week, but last week, I went down to the bins, the Goodwill bins in Sarasota. Um, mostly, it was mostly hard goods down there. So, I didn't get a lot. I think I spent, I don't know, like 23 or 26 bucks. Um, I bought, I picked up a couple of Maggie Sweet jackets. This is a, a purple one, which is a size a large. And it's a size large. It's beaded and has some detailing there. And of course, it's my favorite color. And all of these items cost me a dollar eight, eighteen from uh, the Goodwill bins. I also picked up this skirt. It's not Maggie Sweet, but I thought it's, it's Stephanie Andrews, and it's a large. And I thought... Um, that it would go well with that purple jacket. So I think I'm going to put that together as a, a bundle. 
I picked up this Maggie Sweet jacket. It's a large and it's black with the cream trim, uh, fringe on all around the edges, the hem, the pockets, and uh, the sleeves. I just thought it was really pretty, really kind of like a classic. I don't know, it's an open, open like jacket type. And then there was another, there was a pair of Maggie Sweet Sorry, black pants, which are stuck. So anyway, Maggie Sweet black pants. And they were a petite large. So I may put that together also. Um, today I picked up, I went down to the, um, uh, my local uh, church run thrift store in Landa Lakes, and, but I didn't get there till like 3.30 and they closed at four. So I didn't, the only piece of clothing that I picked up was this uh, Pure Jill, J. Jill uh, blue maxi dress. Um, I'm, I'm gonna try and start picking up some uh, uh, like summer items because Florida, you can wear them all, all year round. Um, I ordered um, a few pieces off of Poshmark from a lady that was um, going, that, that was closing her store on Poshmark. I got a Free People size large, um, little blue and um, red, kind of like a crop top. I think it, you can wear it either way, like off the shoulder or, you know, on the shoulder, it's smocked at the waist. Really cute. I paid like um, $12 for that, I think. This was a We The Free, and I think it was a size medium, and it's like a, uh, it's called the... Uh, something to the right so it hangs off of your right shoulder and then it's got um, a big slit on the side and it's got an asymmetrical hem I don't know if you can see it but that's what that looks like and I think I paid like $12 for that and then this was a free people intimately free new with tags um, it uh, was originally $58. Really cute, like, ruffled tank top. Really pretty color. Um, and I got that for $5. Um, I went to a yard sale at, uh, it was in uh, uh, Zephyr Hills. I picked up a couple of pieces of clothing there. Um, this is by Theory, which retails pretty high. I have uh, sold one Theory. It's just a little uh, black and white cropped sweater. And then I picked up, uh, I guess I should tell you how much I'm gonna um, charge for all of this. Um, the J. Jill, I'll probably, I don't know, maybe 20 bucks. This, I'll probably post it for like 20, 25. The Free People, probably 25 to 30. The Maggie Sweet stuff, um, probably 25 to 30. This is a Chico's Travelers, size one, which is a medium, and it's just a full zip um, hooded little vest, and it has uh, pockets on the front. And uh, the last two, these two, I paid $2 a piece for. So I'll probably post those for like $25. Um, I picked up a Chico size 3. Um, it's kind of like a sweater poncho. It's open and it's got, it's round, um, kind of, uh, I call it a sweater poncho. And I, I honestly don't remember where I got it, but I'll probably post it for um, 2025. 
I picked up a Britney Spears t-shirt. So I'm probably going to post that for 25. I believe I got this, the Britney Spears at the um, Goodwill Bins down in Sarasota. This is a Reason jacket. It's a men's denim jacket. I got it at, um, and it's, I mean, it's really printed up with uh, Amer American military sayings and stuff like that. Um, that's the back. It's a size extra large. It's button up. Um, I got this at um, Plato's Closet, and that was the only uh, thing that wasn't on clearance. It was $16, but I, it was on sale for 11 so I picked that up. I Google lensed it while I was there, and there was one posted for $150 and one posted for $99. So I posted mine for $99. We'll see how, where it goes. Um, I picked up a Lauren Ralph Lauren size medium, real pretty black sweater. Um, it is a, a zip front, really pretty. Um, don't remember where I got it. I'll probably post it for 20 to 25. I also bought a, from the lady that was going out of business, I bought a uh, mystery box for $32. It had six items in it. So everything, all the items ended up being $5.33. There was a White House Black Market um, gray long sleeve um, sweater with some a velvet belt type thing on there. Uh, probably fifteen twenty. There was a uh, new a tag by Areev, I think. I'm not really sure how to say it. A A apostrophe R E V E. Um, pretty. It's, pretty black uh, black skirt um, it's a size medium the tag says it was 4150 it's got the gold elastic band it has uh, sequins and embroidery and tool on the bottom it's lined so I think I posted it for like um, $25 I bought a Matilda Jane little size small tiered skirt for five dollars from the same lady um this was in the uh, mystery box i would not have picked it up but um it's bell by uh kim gravel it's a medium it's just like a camel colored uh long sleeve sweater with faux pearl buttons all around the neck probably fifteen twenty. This is a new with tags, uh, Can't See Cole. And it is a red open cardigan type jacket, all sequined, full sequined. It is pretty, it's probably prettier in person than on camera. So probably 2025 on that. This was an unbranded uh, maxi dress with color blocking red, white, and then the um, animal print. It has pockets and a side slit. So probably 15, 20 on that. This was a new with tag. It says five besties in Los Angeles, which is probably some kind of a boutique. Very good. It's gonna be good for the um, summer. It's a, long, it's a maxi dress. And it also has pockets. Um, I don't think it has a slit, but it did have pockets. Real pretty peach color, floral, probably fifteen twenty on that. Um, I picked up a pair of AG, um, which is Adriano Goldschmid, Goldschmid black jeans and they were a size uh they're the graduate tailored leg and a size 36 32 so um, probably post those for 2530 um i picked up a um lauren ralph lauren size 12 just a black 
like pencil skirt. And forgive the uh, <laughs> the fuzz. I'll have to uh, definitely lint roll that one. I did wash it, but I probably got lint from the couch. Um, today, when I went to the Salvation Army after I did the uh, by the pound sale, because I don't know, there was a lot of pants there today. Um, just I don't know, it just didn't seem to be. Um, good picking today. Um, so I went through the regular um, Goodwill and uh, I picked up a Madewell extra extra small new with tags real cute little purple and white um, checked button down crop top. Um, I think they sell for I don't know like about $78 so I'll probably price it. I think I paid um, I paid $5.99 so I'll probably price it at $30. This is the first time that I've picked up this brand. It's called Marine Layer, size small. It's just a cute little um, striped t-shirt. And I think I paid six bucks. So I'm probably gonna list that for $25, $30. I got this, it is a cute little Vans dress, little, uh, not mini, I would say uh, knee length. Cute little dress. And I only paid $2 and no, $3 for it. So I'll probably post that for like 20 bucks. And the last thing that I got out in the store was a pure, no, a J. Jill Love Linen, size small, 100% linen white tunic top, three quarter sleeve. It's got the little layered look there on the front and uh, like a half button. So um, real pretty. Uh, I'll probably list that for 25. Now I'm gonna dig into what I got at the um, by the pound sale for today at, at the Salvation Army. I did manage to find a pair of figs. Um, I don't know, I don't even know how much uh, these items cost because I haven't counted them to see how much I have. But like I said, I only paid $16 for all of this stuff. So figs is a very good, these are a size extra large, the technical collection. They're um, like uh, medical pants, uh, nurses pants, doctor pants and uh, their figs, and they're very, very popular. I picked up a couple of pairs, and I've already sold one, um, I think for like $25. These look like men's, so I'll probably list these for around $25.30. Nice gray color. Looks like I might need to wash, wash it, because there looks like there might be a little dirt on the bottom of the pants, so I'll throw those in the wash. These I thought were really cute. They are uh, So Slimming Girlfriend Slim, <coughs> excuse me, Leg Ankle by Chico's. They are a size 10 petite. They're black and they have all this beautiful purple embroidery on the legs. And I just thought that was absolutely gorgeous. Of course, you know, purple is my favorite color and very stretchy, so I'll probably list those for $25.30. I picked this up for myself. Um, it is a democracy, just a cute little uh, open cardigan, gray and uh, blue striped, so I'm gonna keep that for myself. Every now and then I buy myself something. I picked up some Calvin Klein size four uh, button front shorts for the upcoming uh, spring. Probably $20 on those. I picked this up because, I don't know, I thought it was cute. It's by Comfort Colors. It's just a medium crop top t-shirt and it says Vampire Weekend Summer Tour 18. Um, 
Well, I guess it was Salisbury, UK, Splendor in the Grass, Byron Bay, NSW, Australia, um, Fuji Rock Festival, uh, Nagata, Japan, Lollapalooza in Chicago, Illinois. So I guess it came from uh, Lollapalooza. So probably $15 on that. Sorry, I got thirsty. My throat was getting dry too. I picked this up. It's by Southern Lure. It's a size large. I do not know how it will do. It just says Southern Lure there on the front and it, and it has a picture of a duck on the back. So I'll have to Google that. I don't know anything about it. But I thought somebody that fished might like it. This I picked up because it's uh, by Vans Speakeasy. And then on the back, it has the Grim Reaper. Well, it both has the, well, they both have the Grim Reaper. Vans off the wall since 1966, the original. And then it's got the speakeasy, the Grim Reaper with the beer in his hand. So I figured somebody might like that. That likes Vans, maybe 15, 20 bucks. This I uh, picked up for myself also. Um, this is from, by So. It's a Lounge Life Weekend sweatshirt. It's gray. One of the arms is inside. I might have should have looked at that. It's kind of a washed out color gray, but I liked it, so I bought it for myself. And the last thing in this bag is another t-shirt, uh, Go Anywhere do anything jeep and i don't know if you know i i've sold quite a few jeep t-shirts and this is a size uh medium so probably 15 20 bucks on that my second bag that i got today i don't know anything about this brand um it is uh Thread story, size large. It's new with tag. Um, it's blue and white. It's long sleeve and it ties in the front. And it's kind of like cropped in the front and then it has a long like train in the back. So I don't know anything about the brand. So I'll have to Google it and do some more research. But I basically got it because it was uh, new with tags. And I picked up an Abercrombie & Fitch extra small little kids uh, full zip Sherpa hooded jacket. Don't know how much that is. I'm gonna guess 25, 25 to 30. I picked up a pair of size um, 3X. Um, Jordan shorts, men's basketball shorts in uh, blue and yellow and gray. So like I said, I'm Oh, they do have pockets, so I'm getting ready for spring and summer. I picked up a pair of Abercrombie and Fitch, the Mom Short High Rise. It's a size 0, 25, Curve Love. So, cute. And they zip. I picked this up. I thought it was kind of cute. It is by Attitudes, Attitudes by Renee, it's, and it's a size 3X. It's just a little animal print sweater so maybe 15 20 on that my son um went up there to see what you know all the uh hullabaloo about the by the pound sale was it's this is by um i don't know who it's by it says dry clean only made in the usa it's by dan forth and gif gift for Jacobson's. It's probably vintage and it is 
pure camel hair, a men's blazer. So I will more than likely, I'll steam it. I'm gonna look at it and see if I need to get it dry cleaned. Um, I might need to get it dry cleaned, but I'll look at it better um, tomorrow. I have no clue what it's worth, but I'm pretty sure it's vintage. I picked up a pair of Victoria's Secret. I think these are um, vintage because it's got the gold tag, Victoria's Secret, and they're 100% silk uh, lounge pants, green lounge pants, very pretty color. So those are nice. I would say probably 20, 25. And then this is my last um, bag <coughs> from uh, today at the Salvation Army. This is Tommy Bahama, size extra large, and it's 100% silk. Real pretty beige color with some floral design on it. Great for a cruise. So... That'll be good for the summer. I picked up a pair of ASOS. Um, and I'm not sure what the fabric content is. But um, it feels like it might have some wool in it, but I'm not sure. But that's what... The ASOS tag looks like they're size uh, 31 and they're a black, uh, I don't know what, what that's called, striped, pinstriped, I don't know, it's not pinstriping, I don't know what it's called, but anyway, uh, trousers, pants, work pants. This I picked up um, because it was new with tag. It was at Ross for $16.99. It is from On Focus um, Studio. And it's a real pretty um, maxi dress. The green belt that ties, it's got a uh, side zip. Do I have to get that? Cut those strings off. And um, I guess it's trying to see. Um, looks like it's got, it's lined down to like your knees, I guess, and then the rest of it goes, the other sheer part goes down below that. But I just thought it was pretty. So I'll probably list that for about twenty dollars. <clears throat> I'll take the uh, Ross tag off of it because it looks like it said that it, uh, comparable value was thirty nine dollars. So it's a size ten. And I picked up a, another pair of ASOS uh, waist thirty uh, green, kind of like a. mid thigh short so probably 15 20 on those this i picked up because it is uh, a pair of uh it's by the brand mesmerize and it's a size 12 and it's like shaper shapewear pants shapewear pants i guess you wear it underneath your pants to hold yourself in but I think it's vintage so um, I'm not sure how much I'll price that at maybe 20 25 not really sure I picked up a pair of Calvin Klein large uh, green plaid pull on pants Oops, Calvin Klein green plaid on pants good work work pants 
and I like that green plaid for some reason. And let's see, the last piece that I got today from uh, Salvation Army was a pair of Lucky Brand jeans, which I don't usually pick up, but um, they were a size 10 and they were a Charlie baby boot jeans. So pretty good size and a boot cut. So probably 15, 20 bucks on those. Maybe 20, 25. Maybe I'll list them for 25 and hope to get 20 out of them. So I'm going to say I pr that everything that I got today was less than a dollar. Because I'm pretty sure I got more than 16 items, I think. So <laughs> that's it for today. I do have some other stuff that I picked up at the um, at Plato's Closet for 90% um, off, but um, it's in the other room. So I'll show it to you um, on my next haul video. I want to thank you for hanging out with me tonight or today, whenever you watch it. Um, you can find me on uh, Poshmark at Brock1902, Depop at Brock1902, eBay at Brock1902 slash Mimi's Closet, and um, Facebook Marketplace, Tammy Brock, I'm not really sure. <laughs> I never, I can never remember what Facebook Marketplace is, but um, I'll put the links down below. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and uh, watch, you know, look for my next videos. I'll try and make them a little more regularly now that it's um, past the holidays. Like I said, I, I truly appreciate you hanging with me and I hope everybody had a Merry Christmas and I hope everybody has a happy and blessed New Year. Have a good night. See you next time.